Okay, let us see. We have launched a probe at a gas shrouded planet, but some of its system failed and, the, and it entered the cloud cover. We need to present an analysis of the data we recovered to discover what happened to the probe. Just one second. So, what happened to the probe? This was the data. Our probe was traveling at a constant speed of 1.45 kilometers per second, that is this here, 14,000. Uh, 1450 meters per second that was the initial speed at the point we lost the ability to monitor the system it made contact with the cloud so they started this de-accelerating with the rocket and this was the de-acceleration of the rockets provided by it the, directly about from the earth from a, from the earth and then it we have fuel for 60 seconds and after that probe went on to the fall in these conditions here so 455.7 seconds and what time was a uh, question was um, how far about the pl planet surface uh, the cloud cover extends and what is the total distance travel of the probe so what we have here we have some kind of probe probe and it's falling down and this was this was the initial speed. At this moment, it hits the clouds. When it hit, hit the clouds, uh, we lost contact with the probe. But it, in this point here, retro boosters starts, and we get the acceleration. <coughs> it starts to break, break with this kind of acceleration. But it moves straight down with less and less speed and that is happening with 60 seconds after 60 seconds we lost the contact and from there it still continues to falling down with under these conditions for 55.7 seconds question is what is the distance this distance here and this is let's say second and this is the third phase of the flight we need overall distance and uh, what exactly how far about the point covers the lens what was the total distance traveled that is the same thing okay that was the questions and now we're going to see some answers that i provided five years ago okay so this is a constant motion now this is when we hit the cloud surface so this is the initial motion and this is the total deacceleration and this is the speed for that so this is the speed after some time t when you move with the initial speed and this is the overall acceleration so movement in is downwards and overall acceleration is upwards so there is a minus here because of that in other words speed will get reduced smaller and smaller and this is how you calculate that and that speed was 82 meters per second if this here was let's say 80 seconds this thing here be, will would become greater than this one and we will get negative velocity what 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 would be meaning of that so meaning of that would be that this probe would stop on some point and start to move upwards but that did not happen it had 82 meters per second at uh, after the 50 after the 60 seconds of slowing down and in that situation distance that is passed is according to this equation which is more or less standard equation is 45,960 meters all of these times uh, that probe deaccelerates, so it reduces its speed, but it never reaches to the zero. It's almost zero, but not zero. So this is the movement in second phase of the flight. Uh, third phase of the flight is free fall with initial speed. I wrote it here free fall with initial velocity, but that there is no free fall with initial velocity. Doesn't matter. So you uh, free fall with initial speed this thing does not exist but doesn't matter so this is actually when you throw something downwards with this amount of initial speed 
So that is not free fall by definition. It is a fall with initial speed of 82 meters per second. And gravitational acceleration is meter per second squared. And then you will calculate things that you need to calculate for this th third part of this assignment. And if you want for complete written answer, please follow the link in the description. If you want more of this, please subscribe and tell your friends. And onwards you will have explanation as this, just that is not free fall with initial velocity, but fall with initial velocity. So that's all there is to it. Thank you. Bye. Did I say for complete written answer? Please follow the link in the description. If you want more of this, please subscribe and tell your friends. Thank you. Bye.